Today I'm going to discuss with you about business dynamics in Italy. I am Sonu Singh, welcoming you all to my channel. So let's start with our presentation. Italy's performance in key business environment ranking was poor compared to peers. But why is it so? To knowing the answer of this question that why Italy's performance in key business environment ranking was poor compared to peers, we'll proceed to this presentation. And of course, this is not a good thing for Italy that its business environment ranking goes beyond or goes below regional peers. So let's have a look on SWOT analysis of Italy. Let's start with its strengths. Low homicide rate compared to the regional average. Here, homicide rate means rate of killing one person by another. So in Italy, there is low homicide rate as compared to regional average. Second strength is improving logistic ranking. Italy is, Italy is keep on improving its logistics ranking. Now the weaknesses. Excessively high total tax rate tends business profit and low level of higher education attainment. We'll discuss these topics later on. Opportunities. Planned infrastructure spending could boost construction activities. New legislation could increase labor market flexibilities. Now threats. High non-performing loans have created a banking crisis that could weaken the overall economy. The stock market is, market is in danger of contracting significantly in 2016. Now, there are several factors which affects business dynamics in Italy. These factors are regulatory environment, operating risks, access to finance, transport and infrastructure, communication and innovation, education and skill, employment and labor cost. So let's discuss these factors one by one, starting with regulatory environment. There are two, basically two major and regulations or we can say burdens on Italy. First one is high tax that tends all business profits and regulate them to an extent. And second one is bureaucracy, excessive rules and regulations or protocols on businesses. You can see in this chart showing the breakdown of total tax rate, Italy got highest position in total tax rate. Second one is operating risks. Corruption and terrorism are the two major problems for Italy. You can see in this chart showing corruption perception ranking 2015. Here also Italy got the highest ranking among all the countries. Next one is access to finance. Banks are banking crisis threatening access to credit. Banks are not in the condition of giving finance or credit to the bank to the businesses. Transport and infrastructure, logistics are well developed but ranking below regional peers. You can see in this chart, Italy's second position in the... You can see in this chart, Italy is on second position in logistic performance index ranking 2016. The country has a well developed infrastructure offering. However, the quality of its infrastructure could be improved for this. Italian government announced its intention to spend around 3.7 billion euros on infrastructural projects. Communication and innovation. Somewhere and somehow innovation is there in Italy. Innovation, but innovation is below Western European peers. The ICT index of relative well developed overall. Here ITC means ICT means sorry. Information and communication technology. Next one is education and skill. Very low higher education achievement. You can see in this graph, Italy is in lowest position in higher education rates 2010 and 15. Next one is employment and labor cost. High unemployment rates. There are high unemployment rates in Italy because of inflexible hiring and firing practices, inflexible wage determination and difficult employer labor relations. And the best part of my presentation that is thank you. Thanks for watching my presentation. Please do subscribe and share this video. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much.